Meet Luis Galvan, Structure Superintendent for Colorado River Constructors, the contractor building the 183 South project in East Austin. Luis has worked his way up the ranks in the roadway construction industry, and he currently leads a structures crew on the 183 South project. I started up as a laborer, and always, I'm always a hard worker, trying to learn. Um, I hooked up with the foreman that had confidence in me, he started showing me plans, and then Next thing you know, I was a lead man. <clears throat> After the lead man, I was about, maybe about five years, and then he bumped me up to a foreman. And I was a, fi a foreman for about another five years. And then, uh, before you knew it, I was doing foreman, uh, superintendent work, planning, scheduling. Luis joined the industry because he was intrigued by structures, but found the work was rewarding in many different ways. You, the bond, the bond, the camaraderie in between everybody. I mean, I never knew it would be so good. I mean, I was thought that, hey, but the bonding and the brothership between other fellow workers, I mean, that's, that's pretty cool. As a 15-year veteran in the construction industry, Luis has advice for those considering a career in the roadway construction industry. It's, it's a good job. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's good pay, it's a good career, good, good, good benefits, I mean, I mean, I guess most people don't think it, I mean, not a lot of people know how it really is, but it's, it's a good career choice. According to Luis, there are plenty of jobs available and the opportunities for advancement are significant. They're looking for people all the time, so I mean, if you're a hard worker, uh, show, just show what you can do, I mean, you'll go up, you'll go up in this industry. The workers that are most promotable, Luis says, are the ones that know how to lead. The foreman's not there. They don't wait around for the foreman. They take the initiative to continue working. Safety is a top priority on the job site, and Luis says that extensive safety training is required for all workers. From when you get, when you get hired on, you go through orientation, go through orientation, sit through like a five-hour class. They let you know. the. Anything from fall protection, working in heights, that's another, another course you got to take. So, yeah, they, they, they go through their, their obstacles to make, make sure everybody's trained and knows what they're doing. They've got to be safe. I mean, got to go home the way, we, the way we came to work. So, yeah, I mean, got to be safe all the time. Luis says that roadway construction is a great career for those who like a variety in their day. There is truly no typical day in the field. Well, the reason I like it is because we're never doing the same thing all the time. Or we're never in the same place all the time. This is not a regular same place, nine to five job. It keeps, keeps it interesting. It's fun. Luis says that this industry welcomes displaced workers or those who may have had trouble in the past and have turned things around. There are jobs available for those who show initiative regardless of past mistakes. And if someone with a troubled past comes in looking for work, Luis says that opportunities are available. There's guys out here, like you said, uh, that have been in trouble with police, jail time or whatever, get to work here, got too much, they work too much so they stay out of trouble. Uh, but yeah. I mean, they, they strain themselves up. Yeah, I mean, they're always looking for people. It doesn't matter where you come from or what, what, I mean, what your past was. I mean, as long as you, you're a hard worker, stay straight here, I mean, you're good.